everybody. I wanted to go over how to graph absolute value equations and how to find the intersections of those absolute value equations. So I'm going to add a graphing page. To type in the absolute value, I'm going to press the button to the right of the 9. And right here over on the left side is the absolute value bar. So you might have something that says like, oh, absolute value of x plus 4 is going to equal the absolute value of, I don't know, 2x minus 3. So here I have my two absolute value equations. You can see they intersect right there. Sometimes they intersect twice. And so what you want to do is you're going to want to go to the window and you're going to want to zoom out just to double check. See, look, I'm glad I double checked because they do intersect twice. So if they intersect twice, you need to go to Analyze Graph, or if they intersect at all, really. Analyze Graph, the intersection. Click, highlight, click, and then you have to do it again. It doesn't tell you both intersections all right, at the same time. You have to do them individually. So here they intersect at 7, 11. So when I plug in 7, it's going to give me 11 for both equations. And then when I plug in, it looks like negative 1 third, I'll get 3 and 2 thirds. Um, and that's pretty much all there is to it, okay? So, yeah, this little button right here, that's how you make your absolute value ones. Menu, Analyze, Intersection, Click, Highlight, Click. That's all you got to know. All right, hope this helped. Bye.